good evening students today we are going to discuss about uh, gemology gemology is the skill paper for ug physics that is fifth semester first skill paper right okay gemology is the study of gemstones so we are studying about different kinds of gemstones so these gemstones are used in different uh, fields right not only wearing ornaments as well as in medical field also it is mainly applicable nowadays to produce uh, sound effect as well as healing effect so different kinds of chakras are there in our body so based on that uh, we are uh, using that is a different kinds of gemstones right so we are dealing about uh, different kinds of gemstones where it is applicable right that uh, we are going to discuss so in this chapter uh, why we want to study that is a gemology that we are going to discuss as well as uh, in the current topic i am going to explain about uh, how gems are forming what are the methods are there to form gems what is the reason behind it so these are the questions you can raise and uh, answer also you can get it with the help of this topic right okay now we will start that is a gemstone so what is mean by gemstones what is mean by gemstones so uh, these gemstones may be Uh, formed from the rocks different kinds of rocks right you might be knowing in lower classes you might have studied that is a different kinds of rocks sedimentary rocks igneous rocks and uh, metamorphic rocks like that uh, you might have studied so from this rocks only these crystals are forming that is the gemstones are forming so how it is uh, forming sir that is the uh, idea uh, you are going to learn see actually uh, the rocks inside the rocks so many sediments are present so many sediments are present like yeah, the sediments only forming as a crystal so it sediments consists of uh, uh, that is a minerals different kinds of minerals But to form a crystal we need of first one is the basic is a space some phase we required then temperature heat we required then atmosphere air required then volume is another factor to form a crystal volume is another factor to form a crystal right so that is the case we are going to discuss right oh, maybe that is that uh, forming as a crystal we need of these factors space minerals heat then atmospheric pressure these are the factors we required so based on only we are explained that is a different kinds of rocks so all these rocks are interrelated all these rocks are interrelated that cyclic forming only first sediments are forming that sedimentary rock then igneous rocks then magma then metamorphic rocks so like that it is a uh, Uh, cyclic process only it takes place first sediments the sediments are entering into the rocks inside the rocks so and it is forming as a crystal due to various kinds of gas molecules dust particles minerals calcium magnesium zinc uh, like this different minerals combined only uh, it's forming as a crystal that is called uh, gemstones right so this may be the reason uh, to form a crystal yeah. so you, you you might have seen that it's in a different countries the various countries uh, volcanoes are ex- getting explosion due to exploring of volcanoes hot uh, lava is coming out so that like a hot water that is a hot uh, liquid right uh, that is coming out and it is uh, flowing through 
the river so that lava consists of heat particles sediments and when it is mixing with atmospheric gas pressure and sediments so it form as sediments and crystals and when it, it is entering into the rocks inside the rocks it up to it goes to uh, earth's crystal uh, earth's mantle earth's crust so depends upon the temperature depends upon the pressure heat volume everything is its depends the sediments of materials so it entering and some materials uh, filtering itself some materials it goes deeply so this is the case to form as a different kinds of crystals right uh, uh, maybe uh, Uh, you learn about uh, different types of crystals uh, that is a diamond is the best uh, crystal that is a gemstone right uh, so topaz you can say example and then uh, quartz you can say example <laughs>